happy to welcome in right now the promotions manager for the Toledo Walleye, Mike Keedy, who is up in our production booth high atop the Huntington Center. And Mike, I got to tell you, you look pretty good in that uh, Toledo Storm jersey. Tell us a little bit about that. Well, you haven't seen these for a while, have you, No, Matt? it's been a few <laughs> years for me, yes. Well, as you know, every year we celebrate hockey heritage, and we've brought back different throwback jerseys every year, and, and then finally it's time to bring back uh, the most recent team here in Toledo, the Storm, which I'm sure a lot of our diehard fans are going to be really excited about. Uh, we've heard it since day one, um, and we're bringing them back on February 21st and 22nd. Yeah, it's a, it, we're doing the full weekend, right, uh, uh, for, for the jerseys? That's right. We're doing the 21st and 22nd, but importantly, uh, we're going to be auctioning them off after the game on Saturday, the 22nd. But just because it's it's Hockey Heritage Weekend, we wanted to wear them both nights. You know, and that and that and this has really become something, uh, Mike, that, you know, every year it just seems to grow and grow and grow. And, 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 you know, when we get talking about the great history of hockey in this city, it just goes back so far. And there's so many jerseys, there's so many teams, so many players. It's just fun to talk about it for that weekend. It is fun to talk about. We're, we're fortunate that we have the history that we have and we can have as much fun with it. Um, you know, I've had the pleasure to work with a lot of our alumni players. Every Sunday we've been hosting them here for a, a, an open skate. They just come out and skate around together and, you know, we're, we haven't announced anything officially, but we, we're putting something together for Winterfest next year, which will be a lot of fun for the fans. Um, we'll have a lot of that group out here on the 21st and 22nd, so see a lot of their, you know, former fan favorites out here in front of the crowd. And we have more on this, uh, the, the upcoming promotions as well. And while we have you, Mike, let's talk a little bit about that. The Friday night post-game party with the players, that started basically from the beginning and that has really grown into a fun event following all the Friday night games. Yeah, it's it's great. It's free. Anybody with a ticket can come up uh, to the club level lounge after every Friday night game. Players sign autographs. They mingle with the fans. It's a great opportunity for people to meet their favorite player, get to know the guys while they're here in the community. And uh, like you said, it started from the very beginning, and it's something we're always going to continue to do because it's know, a lot it's of fun. It's an interesting schedule too, Mike, uh, coming up because February – uh, is one of the, the slower months as far as home games go. And then we really amp it up in March. So that Heritage uh, Hockey Heritage Weekend be a nice precursor for the, the last month, a month and a half of the season when there's a lot of games coming here at the Huntington Center. Yeah, not as many games in February, but they're, they're going to all be big nights, Saturdays. Then we get into March, kick it off with Pink in the Rink the very first weekend, uh, the first and second. So it's going to be a busy rest of the season. No doubt about it. Of course, your place to go, ToledoWalleye.com. You can uh, view the entire promotional schedule there. You can get your tickets. And, uh, you know, I noticed something last night, too, as well, Mike. When we sell this joint out, it is sold out. Hey, four of the five sellouts this year have been 8,000-plus. Says a lot about our crowds. And we know what Saturdays are like when we get into the Februarys and Marches. Absolutely. And we've got a lot of Saturdays coming up. So people definitely want to call in and get their tickets in advance. Mike, always a pleasure. I don't think you should take that jersey off for a while. <laughs> Just go ahead and wear that one for a bit. I think there's, huh? there's a lot of people here that want one, so <laughs> I, don't, well, I, I, might get, I might get swarmed if I walk out of here. That, that's true, and, of course, there will be some available in the Swamp Shop as well as the ones that we do auction off. So the ones that auction off, though, of course, will have the names of the players and everything. Going to be a lot of fun yep. that weekend coming up in February. Thanks, Mike. Appreciate it as always. Thanks, Matt.